How you doing? This is Ivan from Bite Size Wisdom for Busy People, and I'm back with another quote of the day to have a great day. Today our quote is by Marcus Aurelius. The quote is, I often marvel how it is that though each man loves himself beyond all else, he should yet value his own opinion of himself less than that of others. So today our topic is on making a commitment to our own potential. On our self-development journey, we need to reclaim all the power that we've given away to the external world and redirect that focus to our internal world. Many of us have unconsciously given away much of our power. So on our self-development journey, we learn to become a genuine and objective observer to our life. And by being able to observe ourselves objectively moment to moment, we can come to find out all the various ways in which we've given our power away to the external world. We will see how we react unconsciously and mechanically, and we will discover many of our behaviors that are not in tune with who we want to be, with the life we want to lead. So on my channel, I'm always talking about genuine, sincere self-observation because this is a primary way in which we gain knowledge of ourselves and change ourselves and become more conscious and aware. So if you're new to my channel, I suggest you check out some of my playlists. I have a lot of videos there that can help you develop your practice of self-observation. And in particular, I have this video titled, How to Not Be a Smartphone Zombie. In that video, I go in depth of how to use your attention in a special way in which you learn to become aware of the external and internal simultaneously in the moment. And this requires conscious effort. So the more that you practice this, it's just like going to the gym. Um, it's like an internal muscle that you are going to work on. And as that gets stronger, you will be able to observe yourself objectively for bigger moments of time because most people typically their attention will either be out in the external world primarily or in the internal world and all day long you're jumping back and forth and by not being aware of both simultaneously we are not really aware in our life we are not fully aware so as we get better at doing this then we can use the external world and we will be able to observe our reactions to life's events. And in doing so, we will slowly start to transform the way that we react to life. And essentially, our reactions to life, to our daily events, is our life. So as we start to become more aware of all the ways that we react to life, then slowly we'll start to draw our sense of I from those reactions and if we can see something clearly then we can then pursue another line of action we don't have to go along with our unconscious mechanical reactions we will start to become more conscious so when you can see that you no longer react to life's events in the same way that you did in the past this is a huge step in your own evolution because if you transform your reaction to your life's events you are changing yourself you are changing your life and you will start to grow inner power and you will start to live from the most intrinsic part of your nature from your presence and doing so you will no longer be influenced as much by the external world you will value your own intuition so then the external will have less influence others will be able to deceive you and this is where you want to be right you want to be the master of your life all right guys i hope you enjoyed that quote and once again check out some of those playlists that i have on my channel and until next time i really hope you guys are doing well and take care peace